How do you pronounce that? Mikiel. 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 We're very fortunate that we have David Yeah, uh, sitting very close to us. Uh, so we can have uh, first hand information Pete, of exactly how it is pronounced. Pete Mikiel. His name. You know, with the braids and the headband last game, I couldn't distinguish them from the uh, wide camera view. Because he's kind of like the face of his face. Halos pareho. Ngayon, oh. na, ngayon nakabanda na si itong si Hanikat. Hanikat. So that's how you can distinguish them. Dun lang. That's gonna make things easier. Alam mo itong Tokyo Texas, probably the most explosive uh, offensive uh, duo. Yes. Pero uh, again, parang ipinapakita na itong ligang ito na you cannot win by just uh, using those two imports. Eh. Correct. I mean, that's been the standard. And, I mean, looking at what happened in the last conference of Pure Foods won it all, they really had consistent local support from Roger Yap, from uh, Kirby Raimundo, diba? They, and, they did yeah. not have the explosiveness of Hanikat and... Uh, well, okay, no, sino ba yung gulay? Hanikat hitting a... Si well, anyway, Hanikat, Hanikat hitting from, a long distance shot. Yon, it's Richie from... Uh, brought to you by PLDD Budget Cards. 24 cents a minute. Ito na ang pinakamababang rate to the US, Hawaii, and Canada. This is interesting. They're starting out Art Long with his first touch of the game way out in the perimeter against Hanikat. Dalawang beses na nakakashoot ito si Art Long. Ay, yan na naman si Hanikat. Taklusunod naman. See si Gerald Hanigan and that was a no fear slam brought to you by No Fear Jeans USA. Face your fears, live your dreams. Alam mo, malaking test pa rin to kay Hanigan for him to prove himself against the big imports of the league. I mean, the last game when he had Julius Duoso all over his back, he only had 14 points. Uh, now is another time to prove himself against one of the biggest monsters we have next to Duoso probably, itong si Art Long. Who doesn't smile much. He doesn't like to smile. He's not a smiling <laughs> kind of guy. Here's Benya. Hammered inside. Still gets it up. Continues to pick up that ball. Belasco oh. for three. Malakas. Art Long offensive rebound. Isinubo na lang. Six points. Six Already points. Art Long. All the points of San Miguel. And all the points of uh, Talk and Text from Hanika. Which makes me think, well, now that you mention it, I don't ever s remember seeing Art Long smile. Wala nga. Hindi nga. Hindi. Sabi niya, I'm all business on, in the, ah, in the uh, basketball court. He misses that one, although he was all business. Business was closed. Here's Mikel spinning, going up against oh. Velasco, and that's an offensive ah, well. foul. Oh, kita, kita that already was a gorgeous spin to get away from the baseline, but if he went up with his left, look at this spin. If he went up with his left, he would have been blocked right there by Velasco. So he had to adjust, go to his right, and that left hand, sometimes you have that habit of pushing off. Long replay brought to you by PLDD Teles. Sulit on direct line, Sapag Asenso. So it's still a 7 to 6 count. Peña, Saloops, Wala. Lapanan sa riba, nakuha ni Pistol Pete. Tumatak po si Gilbert Dimape. Here's another thing about Token Tech TJ. Marami nang sabi, they're overloaded with guards. You've got uh, Dimape, you've got Bellano, mm -hmm. Patrick Fran, Patrick Fran pa. uh, Jerome Hersito. Wala na. Is, ah, wala na pala si Jerome Hersito. Yeah, that's Bilano. right. But here's another guy. Uh, let me see. Si Kenny Evans. Evans. Kenny Evans. Apat, diba? So it's that's a lot. It's a talagang sobre. And they do get a bunch of minutes. Well, the thing is, nasaan ay kasi si Coach Bilbeno with his original three guards, si Demape, si Evans, and Ejercito. Uh -huh. Wala pa si Patrick Fran dun, and they were quite happy with that rotation already. Although Ejercito at that time was the one who saw very few minutes. Uh -huh. Well, actually ngayon ang numbers, konting-konti. Uh, karamihan ang uh, numero o minuto na napupunta kay Demape. Correct. Rather Fran than and, Patrick Fran. Fran and Evans have been uh, splitting a, uh, a few minutes, about a dozen minutes. Tapos nandun yung konting sundot ni Belano in about nine minutes a game. Correct. I guess it's a matter of adjustment ba for Patrick Fran to get used to the system. And it's a matter of needing. Depending kung anong kailangan niya, kung kailangan niya na running point guard like Demape or a defensive point guard like Patrick Fran who can spot up on the wings. Right. In the meantime, Victor Pablo with a good shot inside. Unang dalawang putos of a player other than Gerald Honeycutt. 9 to 6 ang ating talaan. This should be a high scoring game. I, I do expect that. I, I, I'm also expecting the intensity of a playoff game because, nga, sabi mo, for one, these two teams really need this game back, especially Talking Text. And saka, syempre, payback time nga naman, di ba? Dahil San Miguel nga po nag-eliminate sa Talking Text ng last conference. Ito sa'yo, sabi ni Bill Bain. Five fifty-seven remaining. Sa ating uh, unang yugto, muli po kami nagbumula sa Cuneta Astrodome. Noli yala po kasama si TJ Manotok at uh, magsisimula na uli ang ating laro dito sa first quarter. Right now, ating score lamang ang token text ng tatlong puntos, nine to six. Hey, 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 
Inbound from the baseline. Boybitz, Binegeke Shea Seals. Seals was simply... Now the art long. Junang it looked no He didn't realize that that pick and roll was developing quite slowly. Oh. Shea Seals scored 26 points in 36 minutes. Mm -hmm. Laban sa FedEx, a, a game where uh, Art Long hardly played, played only 25 minutes. But he was uh, beleaguered with foul trouble. Oh. Lago sa labas. Rebound, tinalo. Oh, boy, Miss Victoria. Si Hanikat. Five and a half remaining. Pinasok sa loob. Art Long, laban kay Hanikat. Again, the power. Wala, offensive rebound. Pena with the right hand. And that is the value of Dorian Pena. Grabe. As we mentioned kanina, I mean, Art Long is the one that takes away the uh, attention of the big man of the other team and uh, he gets to roam free oh. under the paint, get those offensive boards or those drop passes. Pena is averaging 13 points a game and 9.6 rebounds as you see a long distance shot here brought to you by PLDD Budget Cards. So 24 cents a minute, ito na ang rate to the US, Hawaii at Canada. Looks like Hanukkah really does not like who well, doesn't want to have a three-game losing season and does not, did not enjoy a 14-point game. Oh. He's very, very offensive-minded tonight. Well, double digits now, see Gerald Honeycutt, mm. 10 points already. A foul, may pinito dito si referee Lagan. First foul ni Elmer Lago. Here's uh, Honeycutt in action, or rather, yes, Honeycutt in action from long distance. And that slow-mo replay was brought to you by PLDT Telesulit on direct line sa pag -asenso. But must na natin kung gaano pa rin kagigil to sa opensa si Hanikat. His, his conference and career high actually has been in this conference. 44 points po na gawa niya. Ba? And, uh, eh, kailangan na kailangan eh. Although, I know, minsan sa dulo, okay, maganda yung simula mo eh, di ba? Correct. Pero sa dulo, kinakapos ito sa Hanikat. Exactly. And that's... Tatagal ba siya ng 40 minutes? Na ganong klaseng 40 ano? quality minutes, oh, diba? You can stay in the game for 40 minutes, but it, it's a matter of being consistent oh. all throughout the game, being 100%. Tap out there by the Talking Text defense. They're up by four. Aliyup! Napulot ni Peña. Binalik ki Art Long, smaller man on him. Laglag ki Peña. Mulin! Exactly. No Fear Slam brought to you by No Fear Jeans USA. Face your fears, live your dreams. Exactly what we were talking about earlier. The second option has already happened. Yung kanina, offensive rebound. Ngayon naman, drop pass from his buddy Art Long. If he can just get his... You know, kaibahan lang ni Hanikate. Now Art Long is getting his teammates involved. Correct. Pablo hits a jumper there. Sa kabilang panig, parang si Hanikat, pag nakuha niya yung bola, eh, hindi, you cannot expect the pass to be given to a local. Well, it depends. No? Kasi for one thing, si Art Long always gets good position deep inside because he's so strong. Uh -huh. He already bangs you deep and he gets good position deep close to the basket. Kaya pag nato-double na siya, all he has to do is jump and drop it. And he's so tall and so athletic. I think he's actually a higher leaper than Hanikat, quite uh -huh. obviously. Uh -huh. Aside from being probably an inch or two taller. Bill Beno. Not liking that last call. It was a hand-checked foul. Abanke beat Michael. And that is the second foul. Or oh, Lago is called for the foul. Huh? Lago? Lago wasn't even there. Lago was called for the foul. Really? They didn't adjust it? Papano? Oh, papano napunta kay Lago yun? Oh, no. Mariano. Uh, baka hindi nakita yung senya sa table. 3 ang nakita. Eh, ang layo ni Lago eh. Oh. Yun, tinawagan si Pete Michael. Hand check pa. Kaya hindi nagustuhan yun ni ano eh. Ni Bill Beno. At yun, eh, hindi na sa loob si Shea Seals. Shea Seals with his first two points of the game. 14 contra 12. Lapang po ang token text ang dalawa. Sa labas, yan ang sinasabi natin. Pagka pulot ng bola, tira na eh. Well, sinusubukan kasi gawin ng Talking Text na balik pa rin ang mundo ng offense na. They're pulling Honeycutt uh, out, taking, making him take the outside shots, thus taking Art Long out of the paint. Ayun. So, kum, kumbaga, kung lumabas na ng gusto, may kumakat dyan. If they get some good screens and get some open cutters inside, they'll have an easier time of making those layups when Art Long is not there. Ang sinasabi mo, deliberate yan ito sa ginagawa? Sadya yan, oh, dinataas talaga sadya siya. Talaga. Okay. Tapos si Mikhail yung pinapamposte against uh, Peña. Well, it has uh, worked so far para sa talk and text with Hanikat delivering 10 points. Pero dun sa huling pagkakataon, may foul on the rebound play. And Nick Velasco back on the line. 
That's always been the beauty of having somebody like Hanika, who's really an inside-outside kind of guy. You know, he, in any given situation like this, where you really want to pull out the opposing team's big man from their defensive set, he can just you know camp out there in three point line and keep shooting all night. High low play. Nilabas ni Hanika. Gets it to Dimape. 14 seconds sa kanilang shot clock. They look for Pablo. Pero tinatawuan ni Velasco. Outside shot by the lefty. Wala. Now, unfortunately, Mikhail does not look as gifted as Hanika from the outside. Oh. Diba? Parang hindi ganun kaswabe yung outside shot niya. So and Peña. One of the few turnovers we've seen. In the meantime, patuloy ang action and a nice pass inside to Victor Pablo from Pete Michael. At ang toque text, lamang na naman ang dalawa. Yes, that is a long distance shot brought to you by PLDT Budget Cards. 24 cents a minute. Ito na ang pinakamababang rate to the US, Hawaii, and Canada. At sabi mo nga, si Nick Velasco just uh, has scanned that three. Like, Grabe, no? uh, he owns it. 45% in this conference. Grabe. Amazing. For a guy who used to play power forward. Well, of course, we have to acknowledge the fact that the three point line is short. Uh oh. Uh -oh. That is a no fear slam brought to you by No Fear Jeans USA. Face your fears, live your dreams. Bihiram bihira yun. Si Art Long mga kaagaw. Ito mga katapos. Tatapik ang bola. Kila sa kamay ni Hanika. Nice pass. Nice pass. Oh, yes. Wow. That was another No Fear slam brought to you by No Fear Jeans USA. Face your fears, live your dreams. Great vision there by Gilbert Dimapin. And you know, for the... Strengths. And it's not he has his own. I mean, he may not be as good as a defender, but he is a good passer and he likes to run the floor. So Dimapi is averaging three assists per ball game, also about five points and two rebounds in 20 minutes of action. In fact, you remember that this guy raised a lot of eyebrows when Coach Dewey last drafted him quite early in the draft uh -huh. last year. That's right. I wonder what, what was he? Was he in the first round? First round. First round. First round. Diba? First round. First round. First round. First round. First Marami pa kasi pwede puliin, oh. piliin ito. Samantala, pumasok mo si Mark Talan with only 38.7 seconds remaining. Dito sa ating first quarter. Zimape, and there's a hand check foul. Lapat kay Joey Pente, who is also in the game now. They have been so consistent with a hand check foul. Especially with our FIBA rules. Talagang once... Even if your pinky is there, without pressure, it's a foul. <laughs> so as not to impede his uh, motion, or he was chancy. I don't know. Okay, fine. Okay. <laughs> around, the Michael, he gets his own miss. Lumabas siya. Hanika Salabas. He will take a long one. Way up there. He's continuing to pop them up. In his last game where he had 14 points against Red Bull, he was 0 for 6 from 3-point range. So, siguro, kikin na kikin talaga siyang pawiin yung percentage niya. Only 6 seconds remaining. Alam ni Jay Seals has been looking up at the clock. Only 3 seconds to go. He takes the long bomb. Yes! Bam. That is a no, or rather, that is a long distance shot brought to you by PLDD Budget Card at the buzzer. Ilocan, as you take a look at uh, Mr. Henry Coanco of San Miguel uh, Corporation, as well as Coach John Oichiko. Asi Taulama hey. is also in the house. Ang uh, mother team niya, ang Talk and Text Fun Pals, of course, playing today. And alam mo, uh, actually, itong uh, larong ito, eh, napakahalaga sa kopunan ng uh, Talk and Text as we take a look at the first quarter numbers here, dominated by San Miguel. Napakahalaga para sa Talk and Text because if they should win, it will really force the Selecta RP team, the only team actually that can join the quarterfinals, 
to win the to uh, to win their last two games. Kung hindi, kung matatalo yan, actually miski matalo pa o, kung mananalo naman ng token text tapos na eh, no? Mm, right. So that's how important this game is. Eh. Just to put a little distance between the token text phone pals at saka yung uh, selecta RP team. Wala na bang wala na ba sa picture diyan ang shell? Well, lang shell oh. Ano ba? Oh, oh kalanga din sila manalo, of course. Yeah. Oh. I mean, but we're talking about between token text and exactly. the RP team. Oh, yeah, no. Oh. Joey Mentes, alabas sa ba, pinabanda pa yung tres. Long distance shot. Brought by PLDD Budget Card. 24 cents a minute. Ito na ang pinakamababang rate to the US, Hawaii at Canada. Mente actually averages uh, 37.5% from three-point range. Mm -hmm. Now he's four out of nine, so tinaas pa niya. Well, this is going to be an interesting point guard matchup. You've got Mente versus Evans. Oh. Two spark plugs. Kenny Evans replaced uh, Gilbert DeMape as you take a look at that last three-pointer. From Joey Mente. Lusot si Michael. He goes off the window. Wow. And beat Michael now with a total of four. Nice, strong, and quick move. Realizing the double team was coming right away once he received the ball. Turning right away and having that nice soft looper. Hard long. Laban ni Hanikat. Isang bangga. Mente. Sasaksak sa loob. Aray! Oh. Very moment. Alam mo, he's like, Ooh. parang may hagdanan laging inaakyat eh. Grabe, no? Follow on Joey Mente. And that is number three. Watch this, ah. Look at how high he gets up. He will just, parang naglalakad and then he will just oh. uh, climb the stairs. Siguro kung bumuka ka na lang siya eh, malulusot niya si Mark na lang. <laughs> Kasi yung lead niya eh. Oh. So he really looks like parang he's flying. Correct. They go down low. Nilapas kay Hanikat. Long distance shot. <laughs> Off to the right and out. Yeah, he's missed Mente. his last four attempts from three. And they have been good attempts. Now. He uh -huh. hasn't been forcing them. After making his first two. Mm -hmm. Art Long has been silent. Uy! Nagigil siya. Nakita niya walang help defense sa likod ni Hanikat. Eh. Uh -huh. And he said everybody's back was turned to the play. So he's had opportunity to take the base down. Actually, see Art Long and uh, Pete Michael come from the same university, University oh. of Cincinnati. Kasama rin nila si Jermaine Tate and si Damon Flint, including the former Barangay Ginebra import, si Ryan Fletcher, the, the white import ng Barangay Ginebra. And the player of uh, the New Jersey Nets, si Kenyon Martin. That's right. Seven-point ball game. San Miguel on top. Back-to-back oh. <laughs> -back careless errors by the Beerman imports. Any success, my fault, my fault. Napaka silent operator talaga tong si Steve. So oh, he's just, oh. just does his bit. Workers lang talaga, oh. professionals. Ito mga nice emotional. Oh. Oh. Manikat, yeah. lang, at saka long. Uh, at the top of my head. At saka yung mga nagpapakita si Rose Green. Yan, oh, may, yeah. may, ano, may show, showmanship. Oh. Oh. Ganun yung mga simple-simpleng uh, paglalaro. Marami dyan. Si Wosu is... Uh, oh. Si Ron Hale just does his business like uh, this. Is baseball. Oh. Oh, nice. si Howard is a Long distance shot brought by PLDD Budget Cards. So 24 cents a minute. Ito na ang pinakababang rate to the U.S. Hawaii at Canada steals with 8 points now in his first or second 3-point conversion. And there's a foul. Malaki Art Long. Well, shoving in the lane there as you see this 3-point shot by Seals in the face. Of Mark Delan. So a replay brought to you by PLDT Teles. Sulit ang direct line sa pag-asenso. So medyo uh, getting to know you stay check of si Hanikat saka si Long. After that uh, shot foul. And they've been uh, chatting. Yeah, kagaya na sinabi natin, this is the venue where Art Long just uh, blew his top. Including the roof of the Coneta Astrodome. Outside shot, seals with another bomb. Wala, rebound ni Michael. They look for Honeycutt. That's a low block. Lamaki Art Long moves in. Michael step back jumper, left hand. Wala pa rin. Under seven minutes to go. Dito sa second quarter. It's gotten a little cold, huh? Both teams actually. Yes. Cut. Kenny Evans hesitation move. Draws the defense. Hanikat libre. And his 12th point of the game. 
eventually papasok din. He's getting good shots. I mean, they're spacing out very well. They're patient enough to move that ball. And he is getting the good looks. Unfortunate lang, before that shot that he just drained, he missed four consecutively from the outside. Let me just correct that. 14 points for Gerald Honeycutt now. Four points in the second quarter. Anin na lamang ang abante ng San Miguel. Oras bumaba na sa anin na minuto at labing limang saglit. Fall away, malakas. Quickly to Michael. Here's Pisto Pete against Art Long. The fake kicks it out to Lago. Goes baseline. In that uh, front court. What I'm liking about the defense of San Miguel, they're not allowing Talking Pets to penetrate. Oh. Every initial drive they want to do is they're able to stop it. Well, ngayon ang ginagawa ng Talking Pets, puro galos. All our friends. Traveling. There's a traveling violation laban kay Art Long. Ba, marami-rami na ang turnovers ng imports ng San Miguel dito sa second quarter natin. Giving the opportunity for Talking Pets to crawl back in this game. But that's been rare, as we mentioned earlier. Bihir natin nakita mga player ng Token Dex na nakakapag penetrate. Oh. That's been one of the rare times, and we almost had it. I guess we're seeing the domination here ng imports ng Token Dex. They have combined for a total of 20 of the 26 ng Token Dex. The only other player scoring is Victor Pablo, who's not uh, even on the floor now. Well, babalik na siyang si Patrick Fran pala papaso. So it just goes to show what we were talking about at the start of the game the lack of the consistent local support. Oh. Patrick Fran text. replacing Jerome Hersito. So now Fran is playing number two. And he will take on Shea Seals as we take a look at some turnover numbers here. Mm -hmm. Looking at the turnovers. In this quarter alone, lima na po ang San Miguel. Isa lang para sa talking text. And there you go. The defense of Patrick Fran already paying off. And an offensive foul. Laban the Art Long. So another turnover by the imports. Okay, here and, we go. Uh, he's starting to chat here we go. with one of his best friends here. Let's see referee Ernie De Leon. And, and he gets it. There he goes. That's he knows him very well. And that is his third foul. Yep. And he may just be thrown out here. If he stops, if he doesn't stop. Chatting. And uh, Art Long is now talking to uh, referee Ernie De Leon, who's right in front of the commissioner. Commissioner June Bernardino. So, so yan, ilang free throw to one or two? It, that still confuses me. If it's bench technical, you get two. And this would this be is a one. free throw, a single free throw and for Pete possession. Michael. Okay. But more importantly, that is the third foul now on Art Long. So, upo siya ngayon. Upo na naman siya. Enjoy the Cuneta Astrodome bench uh -huh. until the third quarter. At ngayon, kung kailan pa humahabol na itong talking decks, uh -huh. and they've been turning the ball over again and again, not good for San Miguel at this point. So now something able to prove himself that he can contribute and actually dominate the offense without Art Long on the court. But against a big uh, mobile line team, that that's a question. That may be yeah. different. Oh, here's Shea Seals going inside. Tough shot. You know, you know, he's now beginning to take over. Lead us down to a single point. Shea Seals now in double digits with 10. Three point lead para sa San Miguel Beerman. Of course, pag nandiyan si Dorian Peña, it always looks like you have another import. Pati pa yun. Diba? Lalo na ngayon, the way he's so agile. Oh. Losing all those pounds. Alam mo, may kulento sa akin si, si Bill Velasco na hindi ako makapaniwala. Yung middle name ni Dorian. Oh. Oh, it's also fruity. Oh, no, I no. swear. Oh, no. Strawberry. Said, no, oh, but no. I mean, I'll, I'll figure it Apple. out. Apple. Hindi naman. Mansanas. Basta, tuwan tuwa Chico. sila. Nung, Chico. Basta. <laughs> tuwan tuwa sila nung simula nung MB na pumasok nung mamang to na durian na, tas, that middle name, and then pinya pa. Basta, kukain kayo para sa'yo. Uh -huh. Nakikinig si, si Bill ngayon. Bill, paki-text mo si TJ. Oh, Oo, sige. Oh. <laughs> 32 to 29. I wouldn't be surprised if it's buko. <laughs> Rambutan eh. Rambutan. <laughs> yes, that middle name game. Mark Delan, mahina sa pangalawa. Rebound, tinapik mula sa likod. Rebound, nakuha pa rin ni Michael. Ngayon, it's starting to show the... Laki, they're no? missing long. Yes. 
tap out by Shea Seals. Seals now taking on Pete Michael. Samantala, ang kumukuha na kid, uh, Honeycutt is Dorian Peña. So the rotation has to be changed. Gamboa is there on Mark Telan. And a 30-second timeout has been requested by the Governor's Cup, which really doesn't uh, look very well. At all. We've seen how... Uleki. Oh, see. I mean, that guy was a good player, but it was also attitude problems that, oh. that uh, decided. His fate. Yep. In the meantime, Tokentek's fate lies in their own hands right now. What with uh, Art Long out of the ball game with three fouls. And all of a sudden, a resurgent offense for them. Evans and Akitimon. They go down low. Big Michael. Seals is on him. Kicks it out. Frank for three for the lead. Voila. Lago also in the game now. That's Dwight Lago for more firepower. Again, look at uh, Peña just challenging everyone here. And you know, you hustle ni Peña. Gives him the benefit of the doubt. Eh? Correct. Not too many calls on him whenever he tries to battle for the ball. Correct. Because he's just running there and because of his size and his momentum, oh. nababanggat, nababal niya talaga yung mga, mga binabanggan. Eh. Double team on uh, Honeycutt. Cross court. Libre si Patrick Fran. He's got to nail Ooh. that one. Wala pa rin. And he already wanted to get his rhythm with that uh, rhythm dribble, is what they call for the shooters to try to get that. Uh... Another oh. outside bomb here. That is a long distance shot brought to you by PLDD Budget Card. The 24 cents a minute to Napi Nagbababang rate to the US, Hawaii, and Canada, San Miguel, weathering the loss of Art Long. They're on top by seven. Seven point lead. Ito para sa San Miguel. Bagamat wala si Art Long. Uh... Patuloy ang kanina pagsisipag. It's really, ano eh, ginandaan nila sa sipag dito, uh, TJ. You know? Correct. I mean, of course, it helps also to have a hot shooting chase seals on the side. Pero si Hanikat sumagot na. It's been a while na ito si Hanikat eh, nakakuha ng punto. 16 points na para kay Gerald Hanikat. He had uh, 10 points in the first quarter. Ilabas niya kay Lago sa kanto. Nandun yung kanyang kapatid. Diba? Lago versus Lago. Outside shot by Seals. Again! That was another long distance shot brought to you by PLDT Budget Card. Alam mo, it's really reminding you of that situation against FedEx where in Art Long also had to sit out early because of foul trouble and Seals just took over. Seals is shooting an incredible 45% from wow. three-point range. In his last game against FedEx, he shot 57%. Hanikat. So just imagine the perimeter weapons at San Miguel Aste. They've got Velasquez shooting about the mid-40s also from three. You got Seals, and you also have Boivitz Victoria on the court. Plus, Dwight Lago. Gula na lang, three-point shooter mo na to si Boivitz. Sobra na yun. Sobra na yun. Over. Ito, three-point shot na naman. Velasco palobo pa. Rebound. Nakuha ni Hanikat. Takbo ang mga nakasul. Di ba, PMA dala? Sa gitna. Nigay Catalan running the wings, tipped by Michael. Wala pa rin. Medyo malayo lang ang takeoff nito lang, but they did the right thing. Good patience by Dimape waiting for the trailer instead of forcing the issue with Mikhail. Michael. A minute and a half remaining in the second quarter. Seals again in your face. Wala. Takbuhan na naman. But it may be wise to wait for Anika because wala naman si Art Long. Here's Pistol Pete turning around, baseline move, gorgeous shot. And now, the lead is down to four, nine points para kay Pete Michael, the native of Rock Island, Illinois. I guess they opted for another inside player to maximize the versatility of Hanikat being inside and outside. Oh yeah. So, kumbaga, Hanikat can spend more time in the perimeter. Correct. Kasi yung uh, Bugs Johnson eh, talagang parang Bugs Adornado lang yun eh. No, so, na shooter na shooter talaga. Here's that last move by Pete Michael. Spinning, the former Houston Rockets player going up against Velasco. And that slow-mo replay was brought to you by PLDT Tele. Sulit ang direct line sa pag -asenso. We have an update na si Shea Seals is already shooting 4 out of 7 from 3 point line. Which is what he did against FedEx. And we're not yet over. Half time. We're not half time. Exactly. 
Well, he has 18 points already to lead uh, all scorers together with uh, Gerald Honeycutt. Another bomb. Bam. Long distance shot was brought to you by PLDD Budget Card. And San Miguel is doing it from the perimeter. With 39.8 seconds remaining, it just may be a good time for Coach Bill to do some experimenting. Here's the map. Brand popping out from that shot. Libre, libre, no? Ito, libre sa kabila. Wala, mahina. Seven-point lead for the Beermen. Already with their longest winning streak of the season, three games, looking for their fourth straight win. Samantalang ang phone pals have lost their last two and four of their last five games. Here's Seals looking up at the clock. It reads five seconds. Step back, jumper. Wala. Rebound, defeat Michael. May oras pa, second to go. Has to pull the trigger. Nakuna upo sa oras. I'm talking text phone pals. So, uh, kayo do sa aming PBA numbers challenge. Ang aming question for today, August 3. How many points is a basket made from 30 feet? Again, how many points is a basket made from 30 feet? Sagot lang po nyo yung uh, itawag nyo, sagot nyo sa 290. Pete Michael opening up uh, the scoring here in the third quarter to cut down that San Miguel lead to 5. Parehong uh, starting units ng dalawang kopanan. Art Long is back in the game, playing with three personal fouls. Well, of course, pag nakakuha siya ng pang-apat niya, ubo na naman siya. He has eight points, however. Better than his total in his last game, where he only scored six. Offensive foul. Ooh. Dorian Peña. That is number two now on uh, big boy Dorian. So we'll see if Talking Text will adjust their game plan and attack the defense of Art Long, who, as we said, has four fouls. And that's exactly what they're doing. They're going to Mikhail against Art Long. Yun din ang switch ng San Miguel. Now uh, Art Long is taken on. Mikhail, imbis na si Hanikat. Inside, Hanikat. Napayunga ni Seals. Ngayon naman, feeling ni Hanikat, mas kaya ni si Peña. Oo. Oh, so, pero tumutulong ang oh, uh, depensa ng San Miguel. That's what they've been doing well in the first half. They're really collapsing well and helping out. Here's that slow-mo action. Brought to you by PLDT's Telesulit on direct line sa Pagasenso. Bounce pass inside. Natapik ni Pete Michael. Kick out. And then a lane to the basket. Off the back iron. Rebound ni Art Long. Under nine minutes to play. It's so third quarter. A game that is both uh, very interesting and very important. Two teams that met in last conference's uh, actions of the finals as Dorian Peña ups their lead to seven. Well, we just love sneaking in there in the baseline. Hindi siya nabantayan na maigi. Ni Mikhail just took his eyes off of him. Paksak si Honeycutt. Nagulas. At itinapo niya yung bola. No complaints from Sweet Honeycutt. Chapel, I'd like to say a happy anniversary to uh, Dito Romy Villonco. And say hello to all the Villonco clan. Welcome to Bayern Superstars. 45 to 38. Seven point ball game. San Miguel. Nice turn by Arjo. Simple lang. Medyo mahirap na tira para sa kanya. We're not used to. This is where they've been wanting to go. Kick out play. Two seconds to shoot for three. Oh no, this is only a two point shot. Oh, three pala. Long distance shot brought to you by PLDD Budget Cards. 24 cents a minute. Ito na pinakababang rate to the US, Hawaii, and Canada. Pinakabawi pa sa nadun, even though that play really developed so slow for them. Oh, putik na maubuzan eh. Boy, Pits Victoria has been very silent here. Maganda ang depensa sa kanyang gibape. Jay Seals, he exploded in the second quarter. Nice fake, he goes up with a lean-in jumper. Wala. And the shot clock will expire here. It will be a jump ball. It will be a jump ball. Well, that intricacy of that rule saying if the buzzer sounds simultaneously when the ball hits the rim, it's a jump. 
Pero hindi, well, okay. It, it's, it's really weird yeah. rule to me. Yeah. You know? It's a FIBA rule. Although, na, if the no buzzer, yeah, although if the buzzer sounds in the air right after the player releases it, then that's a automatic, automatic. violation. Oh. Wow. Kasi sa, di ba, uh, logic says, pag tinira mo, tumulog ang buzzer, tumama sa buzzer, go yung, tuloy ang play. Yes, oh. in, in regular FIBA oh. rules and in old FIBA rules. This has just been adjusted, I think, after the last Olympics. Girian and Girian, and Peña will be called for the foul. Nako, tatlo na to. Parang nagsasabong silang dalawa to sa ilalim. So now they've got two, they're two big men with three fouls each, with still seven minutes to go in the third quarter. So much more na talagang manlalaki ang mga mata ni Mikael at ni Hanikat na talagang pukpukin sa loob against Peña and Long because either of them who gets a foul, apat na yan. Oh. And no move from Coach Shot Pagkinsen to make any changes here. Muntik na maagaw ni Nick Velasca yung pasa ni Pete Michael di Pablo. Here's Pablo outside looking for his shot. Shot clock is down to 11. Short stab. Wala. Rebound ni Peña. Peña now with a total of six boards. Outside shot to Victoria, short. Here's Pisto Pete running the break. Pinangani Victoria does a foul, almost an end one play. Instead, maybe begin on two free throws, see Pete Michael. When you're looking at San Miguel now, that's looking a little tentative, especially in that last play in a major magayuti ni Victoria and thus giving this fast break opportunity. To Michael, sige na, giyahin kita. Nakakahilo eh, nagmimikil ako, nagmamichael ka eh. Slow-mo replay brought to you by PLDT Tele. Sulit ang direct line sa pag-asin. So, para madali na. Kailangan may cohesion. To Michael ka, Michael. Kasi baka isipin na, dalawang tao pinag-usap pa natin. Kasi kahirap eh. Kasi sa ating mga Pinoy kasi, di ba? Simple lang yan, Michael. Oo, Michael. Si Pete Michael is coming off a stint with the Houston Rockets training camp. Ito po sa Southern California Summer Pro League in Long Beach and prior to that he played for the Kansas City Knights in the American Basketball Association where he was voted MVP mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He's no, uh, I'd be curious though just, just to find out exactly what position he played there oh. That's a, he's an, he looks like an in-between he's a 6'5", 6 6'6 6 6 guy who can play the inside and the outside but he does not have that much of a reliable shooting touch oh 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 oh, oh. <laughs> Medyo nagtimpi na lang si referee Ilagan eh. Nagtimpi na lang eh. Yep. Pero pang-apat na yun ni Art Long. And a useless foul at that. A useless foul indeed. Yung susundot ka na lang nung kung kailan na sunay riba. Ito, tignan natin ha. Kung meron na may... Uh, ayun ang sundot eh. Oo nga naman. Tinamaan ang kamay. And Art Long is going to sit down again with his fourth foul. So this is the second straight game that Art Long has been used sparingly because yep. of foul trouble. Four fouls for the big man. So now we'll see how Talking Text can really take advantage of the hole in the middle. And especially with Peña with four, with three fouls also. So Toya, kagaya niya, wala na nagawa si Peña. Hindi niya may tulak si Hanikat. Now Gamboa's got to do a better job of helping out inside. If you look at that San Miguel lineup, they don't have too many experienced big men there left on the bench. All they have is Carmona left and... Uh... Uy, that's another offensive foul here. So ngayon, kapit-kapit na problema na San Miguel. The lead is down to two here from a high of nine points. It's the third quarter. By the way, to sa mga hindi po nakapanood ng ating first game, nanalo ang Pure Foods laban sa Red Bull. North versus South. Dahil ang Pure Foods ang nasa ilalim, Red Bull ang nasa ibabaw, snapping... Red Bull's winning streak, and in the meantime, Purefoods finally gets their second win mm -hmm. with their new imports, Chris Morris and uh, Warren Rosegreen. Although it's all for not, no, that oh. Purefoods guy has been eliminated already, Good thanks oh, yeah. to FedEx winning, thus eliminating Purefoods and Ginebra. Good hustle here, and this is hustle points. Ito ang kailangan ingatan ng, ng talking deck. San Miguel has proven time and again in this conference that they are a team that really supports their imports well. So even though with Art Long out, the locals, I'm sure, will step up as they have been. Etong si Shea Seals also, as proven in the last game, he can dominate when he wants to. 20 points para kay Shea Seals. Following up his uh, big 26-point performance in his last game. In the meantime, ball will go back to Talking Tex after that miss by Shea Seals. 
Limang minuto na lang po na lang sa third quarter. Lapang ang San Miguel ng apat. They kick it around. Napunta kay Lago sa kanto. Telander sa cut by Michael. And again, Peña just cannot do anything to well, stop the inside play. Exactly. Well, that time around, nice ball movement by Talking Text. Good recognition by Honeycutt. Na di double team siya kagad dahil si Kambuwa na bumabantay sa kanya. And that's gonna open things on the perimeter with the phone pass. May foul si Elmer Lago laban kay Shea Seals. Siya ang mayroong responsibilidad na pigilan itong si Seals. Third foul on Lago. So basically, Bilbeno has been switching with two defenders against Seals. Itong si Patrick Fan and Elmer Lago. Naipit si Shea Seals. Look at Peña dive for the ball. Mahaba pa shot lock. No need for them to rush. Yes. Victoria. On the run. Wala. Rebound. Tinapit ni Hanik at palabas. It will remain... It may just be with San Miguel, yes. Handled last by Gerald Honeycutt. Four twenty-two to go. San Miguel playing with only one import. Art Long picking up his fourth foul in this third quarter. He had three fouls in the first half in a thirty-second timeout. Ang ilingin ngayon ni Shot ng Kinsens. Those guys outside because before you got Art Long with the anchor of your offense, then he gets doubled or they sag down. He kicks it out. He finds them. Now it's going to be a little tougher for them to find those open looks. Oh. Again, we're happy to have you with us, Philippines. Noli yala po kasama si TJ Manotok for our second offering today, Saturday edition ng Samsung PBA Commissioners Cup. Medyo patapos na ang ating elimination round and we're going to that critical quarterfinal phase. A couple of teams already knocked out of the race. In Ebra, saka ang Purefoot, another nice shot from Shea Seals. And he is just shooting the lights out here at the Guneta Astrodome. Well, that's the problem with Patrick Fran on him. I mean, Patrick is quick enough and tough enough to stay right in front of him. But when Seals goes for that fadeaway shot, hindi abot ni Patrick. Hindi niya mabablang kayo. And even the vision, hindi niya masyadong ma-impair. Correct. In the meantime, si Pete Michael patuloy na magpasok sa loob. Here's another tough shot. Oh, what a shot! Doing it on the left side, now doing it on the right side. Seals knows that he will not be able to pass Patrick Fran. But with that drive to the baseline, when Patrick closes it, he'll just have that slight push and give him that enough room to take that fadeaway shot. Seals now with 24 points to lead all scorers. Dito sa laban na to. San Miguel maintaining a four-point lead. They are weathering the storm. A ah, great nice catch. Class. And a great catch by oh, Michael. Man yung yung yun. And he's a lefty. Wow. He to catch him with your offhand like that. Oh. Pwede siyang wide receiver. <laughs> yes. Especially with his build. Oh. Dos puntos ang abante na San Miguel. It's as close as it can get here. Seals again. Short on this shot. Rebound ni Gamboa. Back to Seals. Nowhere to go. Nilabaski Velasco for three. Wala. Rebound ni Hanigat. Opportunity to tie. Tumatak po si Michael. Nandun lamang si Victoria. Nabitawan ng bola at may foul. At tinawag si referee Kalungkagin against Victoria. So the action is picked up here. As, uh, the Still a very good sized crowd again. Doon po sa mga suki natin ng PBA. Pumunta kayo dito sa mga venues natin. Because oh. there are a lot of... Uh, Things are happen, happening during the breaks. Correct. Mga premio, oh, mga premio pinamimigay dito eh. Remember that guy won the 400,000? Nung isang araw. Shot. Napanood ko ngayon eh. Last week, oh. Tapos, uh, yung mga premio, mga t-shirts na pinamimigay dito. Pumarito po po kayo. At uh, maraming, maraming uh, iba pang aksyon na makikita kayo maliman sa basketball. Diba? Tabla na tayo, DJ. 53 mm. all. Although it's been at a slower pace. I'm sure this is not the pace that Coach Bilbeno wanted. That uh, when they lost Art Long, tagal na nun, that was oh. about five minutes ago, he was hoping that they would really begin to pull away. But somehow, San Miguel has found a way to really keep instead with the phone pass and maintain their lead. And although ngayon lang talaga tumabla. It has been a short night for Long. Yeah. The irony of this. <laughs> <laughs> Parang si Glista yan eh. Kumalas yung kadena no, kalaban mo. Medyo you make your move, pero Velasco tuloy, tuloy. continues to grind here. Long distance shot brought to you by BLDT Budget Card to 24 cents a minute. Ito na ang mababang rate to the U.S. Hawaii and Canada. So, uh, San Miguel back in the lead. The last time Token Tex led was back in the first quarter at 14 to 10. Here's Honeycutt for the tie. Yes, another long distance shot here. 
brought to you by PLDD Budget Cards. So 24 cents a minute. Ito na ang pinakamababang rate to the U.S., Hawaii, at Canada. Only Honeycutt's second field goal here in the third quarter. His first outside shot. 23 points for Gerald Honeycutt. Three threes, threes already for him. Roscourt. Velasco will try again. Misses this one. Rebound to Pete Michael. For the lead. They give it to Honeycutt. For the three-point lead. Yes! Long distance shot. Brought to you by PLDD Budget Card. And now, shot ng Kinsen. Nakaamoy na ng panganit. It collapsed pa sa weak side. So, talaga right. sumisikip yung loob. And I seriously doubt them getting inside points anyways. Because San Miguel is so paranoid with that fact na wala si Art Long. That's why it's opening up on the outside. Kenny Evans ang uh, nagtitipon ngayon. San Miguel will have to slow things down here. Jay Seals and the blocking foul, Laban K. Patrick Fran, who stepped into the lane. He expected the dribble, but he was it was ruled a blocking foul. His second foul, penalty na ang talk and text, and that'll send Shea Seals the free throw line. Well, ang uh, talk and text also is in the penalty, so both teams over the limit. A minute and 31 seconds remaining in the third. will have to do it by himself at least for this stretch keep the ship afloat 25 points for seals he has scored 20 points since the wow. first quarter because nga kakulangan ng uh, opensa well, are long. Long. Correct. now he has 26 points 21 since the first quarter lead is down to one Inside, masyadong tusok yung angulo. Well, Seals already matching his career high and conference high, obviously. Which he had in the last game against FedEx. Six points, so this is his most explosive game so far. And again, it's because kailangan gumawa siya. Correct. Ibigyan siya ng pick ni Dorian Peña. Sabi ni Seals, umalis ka dyan. Kaya ko na to. Pinanig niya kay Boybitz, Victoria. Six seconds to shoot. Victoria sees an opening wow. with a left hand. Gorgeous move. So San Miguel again up by one here. Uh, now, well, he's back in the game now. Well, the good thing about it, we heard some uh, young last minute instructions. I got seals, Abini El Bernago. The good thing about it is Art Long is on the bench. Yep. Na San Miguel. So he's keeping uh, warm there, hoping that he can come back strong in the fourth quarter. There's Art Long, the former NBA veteran. Well, with him around, San Miguel has been dominating. One point lead para sa Beerman. Only 46 seconds to go in the third. Well, what has been a very tight contest. The biggest lead has only been nine points. Briefly held by San Miguel. Para to si Demape, inilapas kay Lago. They go down low, Telan. Seven seconds to shoot. Balik kay Telan, three points shot. Wala. And Velasco with a big rebound. That was a good possession though. They were very patient. Space it out well, kicking the ball from inside to outside and back inside and finally settling for a three-point shot. We have not seen Vic Pablo back in the game, DJ. Correct. Siyang uh, gumawa ng first quarter. Para yes, six points. Oh, total of nine already para kay Victor Pablo. Seals. Libre si Lago ng bahagya. They go down low. Peña finally getting a touch here. Oh, the foul. a foul. Right as the shot clock sounded here. And Bill Beno again complaining this one. Honeycutt's going to pick up a second personal foul. As, well, you see his arms are at that angle. But the thing is, he didn't bring it down. It was there already when Peña jumped into him. So discretionary referee. And could have been a let go, no? Yeah, could have been a let go. I mean, the referees always say, if you put your arms down, then it's a foul. But the thing is, that's how it started. When he put his arms up, he was angle. So maybe with that angle, deceived the referees and saying, he was bad. Well, Peña missed his first free throw. 4.7 seconds to go. Double eight production here for Peña. Two misses. Only three seconds to go. Here's Demape throwing a long one and missing that one. So, San Miguel sa pagpapasunan ng fourth quarter. Nine minutes and 46. 
Not into Shea Seals. Art Long, by the way, is back wow. in the game. And Shea Seals. Oh that was a long distance shot brought to you by PLDD Budget Cards. At 24 cents a minute. Ito na pinakbababang rate to the US, Hawaii, and Canada. That is as tough as a three-pointer can get. Oops! Nakaago pa si Seals. 29 points for Seals. This is his uh, career high. Art Long gingerly puts it in. And the return of Mr. Long has given San Miguel a lot of uh, breathing room oh, here. Perfect pass there by Boy with Sintori. And that just goes to show also the kind of influence that Duncan Sen has had on the San Miguel team, the way they've been playing. They've been playing more freely, especially in this last conference. The situation is not good. Nandun si Jong sa kasi Ron Jacobs still bags and oh, slow down. But Shot has somehow let them free, and they've been doing so well like this. Another long distance shot brought to you by PLDD Budget Cards. 24 cents a minute. Ito na pinak mababang rate to the US, Hawaii at Canada. Eight straight points here for San Miguel. And all of play brought to you by PLDD Telesulit and direct line sa pagasenso. Kalangan pa kabalik dito ang field ang talk and text, ha? Pinapik palabas. Well, again, they're going to start anchoring their offense on Gerald Honeycutt at the post against Art Long, but they're still going to be collapsing in double teaming because they won't allow Art Long to take him one-on-one -on -one with him having four fouls at the stage. Oh. Uh -huh. And you really have to give it to the defense of San Miguel. They've done a great job on rotating. Kanina pa, gusto ibigay ni Honeycutt yung bola kay Lago, finally. Correct. Now that's an option they're going to have to keep looking at in this fourth quarter. They started the ball with Honeycutt against Long. They can double, they can rotate. Since they're scrambling, Long had to leave Honeycutt, and Honeycutt was left with only Seals defending him. So they could be hitting him on the swing on the other side. Bad pass. Shea Seals uh, passed outside. Akala ni Lago titiran na siya, so he was going inside for the possible rebound. Eight minutes remaining in this basketball game. In the Governor's Cup last year, when they still had the full complement of players, it has not lost three straight under the Bill Beno era. The Mape with a high looping shot. And the lead is down to five. Alam mo, correction pa lang. Ngayon lang pala nag-adjust si Coach Tanklin said. Nag-2-3 defense na ngayon na San Miguel. This is the first time we're seeing them pull this off in this game. It deceived me a bit kanina. I thought it was just a double and rotate. But no, it's a 2-3 now. Just to keep Art Long from really being on one guy. There is a foul. Called on Demape, his second foul. First team foul on Boca Tex. Seven and a half remaining in this game. Here's Long. He has four fouls. Oh, yes, sir! That was a no fear slam brought to you by No Fear Jeans USA. Face your fears, live your dreams. Kinanabahon niya ng tinanabaho si Hanika. Then finally spun towards the baseline and he got away. He started in too deep already. He was just a, a foot away from the paint. That was too deep for him already. At wala pang help defense from Boca Tex. Tap out by Seals. And again, that 2-3 zone of San Miguel. Well, uh, a little baff baffling, a little bit. Yep. Don't talk Here's that fantastic move. Long. Look at him. Work on uh, Hanika. Then, boom. Exploding to the hole. Slow-mo replay brought to you by PLDD Taylor Sulit on direct line of Pagasenso. There is a foul here. By risky, risky situation there for San Miguel. <laughs> but no, it was on Telan winding off against Art Long. <laughs> Mark Delan picking up his second foul. Second team foul din yan ng talk and text. Malinis pan San Miguel. Deep on the baseline, missing that one. You know, maybe they want to bring back Victor Pablo. Oh, matagal lang unang upo yun. Diba? Yun yung binanggit natin na medyo uminit for the locals in the first half. He has stopped with nine, diba? As a matter of fact, si Victor Pablo leads the local scorers uh, talking text with nine points. I've been one. Here's Seals falling away. Oh, yes, sir. He really has to touch. And he's feeling one it, right? He's oh, feeling yes. it, right? It's a career night. Last, night, last game around, he had 26, now 31 already. He's just a sweet shooter. No doubt about it. 
when he wants to, he can score. Here's Pete Michael. Oh! Foul. Let's see. Who's Silago. Silago umaamin. Silago immediately admits. Oh. Kami <laughs> oh, ako na, ako na. Oh, wag mo lang tignan yung isa, ha? Ako. And immediately, they looked at the hands of Reverie Kalongkagi. <laughs> If they were, if it, it was going to signal two two circles, oh, right. one of the very few times to go in this game that all eyes in the Coliseum were on referee Kalungkagin. Oh, gonna check a cigar for that fleeting <laughs> moment. His his shining moment in glory. Few seconds. Michael at the line, 21 points for Michael, but he has not scored because of fourth quarter, and that is his first point. Was drafted by the Dallas Mavericks in the second round. Uh, no 2000 NBA draft, 58th pick overall. I don't see Pete Michael. Then he was traded to the uh, New York Knicks. I'm gonna pick Pete Michael. 72 to 65, seven point ball game. Velasco, oh. semi hook. Wala, Rivani, Hanika. That was a different look that time for San Miguel. The first time around that they've been isolating. I don't see Nick Velasco. Pipe Zelago na bagya. Inside to Michael, stepped on the line, Ooh. clearly. Tayang. Just ran out of real estate there. Oh. He had a good play, good pass, Maganda. nice cut, diba? Yeah. Would have had that reverse layup against Long, and you know Long wouldn't really go for the big block. Maganda, it was a real nice play developing for them. There's no points. But I mean, ending yung... Close up, Michael! Nainis pa yung ring. 33 points for Mr. 32. And he's not done. They, did they really haven't found anybody who could stop him? No. They've tried Lago. They've tried uh, Patrick Fran. Patrick Fran. And even if they put maybe Pablo, he'd be too slow. Naman. Even if they put somebody taller. Michael, the long is there. Bothering that shot. Lang pa rin siya dun, no? Even though, you know, Long is not afraid. I mean, he's got four fouls, but he's still jumping with them. The pass was yeah. long, you know? Oh. Nice pass! Oh, my God! Runs the ring. That was a no fear slam brought to you by No Fear Jeans USA. Face your fears, live your dreams. And Seals and Long combining. They have a, an 11 point lead now, and that was a little bit of a put down there by Michael, but a very meek reply. Lamanga San Miguel lang siyam. May oras pa dito, ha? Four and a half. But Falkentex has to do it on defense. Complexion of the game may change if Long is uh, fouls out here. Short stab, wala tapik ni Patrick Fran na punta kay Seals. Long will not take the shot. Sabi niya may oras naman eh. And he's a veteran, he knows oh, yes. how to play the game. Tap by Hanikat, na punta kay Michael. Long looking for a foul. Here's Lago, balik kay Michael, who goes up? Oy, that's gonna be goaltending. And bahagyang naabot yun ni Art Long. Oo, oh, nahagip niya na konti. So that'll count, so the lead is down to seven here. Let's watch it again. Long will go up here as the ball will go down. Just a little bit. This is fingernail. Oh. 3.47. Got it to Seals. He has been excellent today. Deep inside is long. That's too deep. That's way too deep. Honeycutt should work harder on defense on that play. Honeycutt for three. No. It may, to, may be too early to go to the court of last resort here. And they're taking their shots pretty early. They're not working their offense around. Ang oras po natin, tatlong minuto, labing apat na saglit. At may foul sa Demape. 13 foul on Token Dex. With 3.14 remaining here. Pablo has not come back to this game. I wonder why. I mean, is he, he's not in foul trouble. Why not? Long. Yes. <laughs> well, the, the the rest did him well. Mm. 20 points for Art Long. 10 points in the fourth quarter. Here's the Mape for three. Yes. Long is the shot brought to you by PLDT Budget Card. So 24 cents a minute. It's not the most rate to the U.S. Jeans USA. Face your fears. Live your dreams. Back to live action. Nick Velasco with the basket. At the Labang of San Miguel. Sampuna naman. Superstars, another 
poorly taken shot mula kay Hanikat. Maaga na naman si Shantak and really no offensive rebounding option there. Last two minutes is brought to you by Barcelona Brandy, a toast to life. Here's Long, 22. Wow. He is just going to town. And San Miguel, again with the way he coach shot on Gensin, just pace his boys, the shuffling of men. I mean, he's done an excellent job. This victory he's, should be a credit to him. You've got to give it to him. I mean, a lot of people are giving the credit to the imports, to the locals stepping up on their offense, but with the way he's been adjusting, also on defense, because when a team does well defensively, that's also a great credit to the coach. And what uh, credit we will give him today, Dahil, uh, here's an offensive foul ball to Pumasa Kintira Ngayon. Because this is going to be the fourth straight win ng San Miguel, their longest winning streak this season. Time now for our moto lang. Isang minuto, dalawang put, tatlong saglit na lamang po nalalabi dito sa ating laban at ang San Miguel, milya-milya na layo, 84-72. At uh, again, nagpasimula yan sa pambihirang shooting ni Seal. Si Art Long ay hinugot na. Mula sa ating laro, he will sit down the rest of this game and what a performance for Art Long uh, hampered with uh, foul trouble early in this game he still ends up with 22 points, 9 rebounds and an incredible 4th quarter for him Samantala, there's a tap out by Seals who has just sim who has simply been excellent he has just been the epitome of consistency and you know, it's scary to see how his game has been consistently improving uh -oh. Since he has come here, his shooting is. Uh, Lalong umiit, oh, right? talaga iba iba yung kanyang ano, shooting touch. And he knows how to pace himself. He knows when to take his shots. Magkendeng kanyang timing. There's a steal by Patrick Fran. He goes up, challenged by Victoria. You know, Seals. Since Seals replaced Damon Flint, San Miguel is now going to go six and one. with Seals and Long together. Their only loss was to Red Bull. And with Red Bull losing ngayong araw pong ito, laban sa Purefoot, San Miguel now owns the hottest streak in the league. Four straight wins. First time since last year's Governor's Cup when they won five in a row spanning the eliminations and the semis. Samantala, Bill Baino will suffer his third straight loss the first time in his coaching career it was a buy in the superstars. And a second remaining, and that'll do it. Coach Shot Tankinsen masterfully uh, shuffling his men, and what a job he has done today. Our final score San Miguel Nanalo, 84 to 72.